Okay, in this video, I will show you how to open an ms-dos file or application file type. This is if you accidentally save um, a file as a .com at the end or something like that, because this is a pain for me because I used to put passwords in my uh, files and I put .com and I could never open them again and view the text, so I'd go insane. Now, first, click File as if you saved it and then you want to hit save as and then once you accidentally type in the dot com or whatever you'll hit save which you probably already did this this is what the file looks like after saving this is what it says when you try to open it ah it won't work so yeah it made me kinda mad to fix this I have one way that will most likely work viewing text in MS-DOS application file because you accidentally saved an important file with a .com or stuff like that at the end. First, add the file to an archiving folder. Using an archiving program like WinRAR or any other archiving software. So first you wanna right click it and then you wanna add it to the archive. And then after you do that, you want to hit OK. Sorry for that lag over there. Just a second ago. Save the archive folder, then open the archive folder. So then you want to right click it. Hit open. Open the ms-dos application file. You should only have to double click the file. It should open to where you are viewing the original text. So here I am with the, the archive open. I double clicked. This is what comes up. <gasps> I can see the original file now and all its original text. And yeah. I love that email. Alright. Now, thanks for watching this. If you like this video, hit that subscribe button. And you can now view the file. Recommended to copy the text and resave it into a new file. Just try not to save a file as the following example unless you want to use this for everything so people don't know how to open your passwords. It'll be a better idea, but I'm not going to do that. Website domain name.com